Hello and welcome to the video. In this video today, we are going to compare two of the popular video animation tools, Create Studio and Videos. I'm not going to go through all the features, templates, and other stuff in this video, because I have already done a detailed review of both these software and shown you how these tools work. So this is going to be a relatively shorter video. You can find the individual review links in the description below. Let's start this video by understanding what videos and Create Studio actually are. What is videos? Videos is a 3D full auto animation and video software using which you can create breathtaking animations with three simple clicks. This is a completely cloud-based software that can be used on any device or operating system. What is Create Studio? Create Studio 2 is another video animation software, but it is a desktop-based tool. And this is the first difference between Create Studio and Videos. As Videos is cloud-based, you can use it on desktops, laptops, tablets, and even mobiles. But to use Create Studio, you will need a computer. You can't use it on tablets or mobiles. By the way, both of these tools need an internet connection to use them. Now, let's look at the biggest difference between videos and Create Studio, which is how they function and what they can produce. Even though both of these are video animation tools, they work in totally different ways. Let me log inside my account to show you what I mean. By the way, I have been using both Create Studio and Videos for quite some time now. Now, if you see here, Videos has a template-based approach for creating videos. Using videos, you can create live-action animations, intros and logo strings, lower thirds, out rows and overlays. You can also create titles and transitions, but you can't create a video from scratch. Whatever you want to do, you will need to use a video template that's already inside your video's account. Creating a video animation inside videos is pretty simple. You can create a video in a few clicks. Choose a video template for your use case, upload your logo, enter the text, choose your colors, choose the music, and publish the video. That's it. You can create a professional quality video animation in a matter of minutes. When it comes to Create Studio, it is a totally different story. While you can create intros, out rows, overlays, etc., you can also create amazing 2D and 3D video animations, cartoon style explainer videos, presentations, social media videos, video ads, and more. Create Studio is a very powerful video animation software. Another cool thing about Create Studio is that you can either create a video from scratch or use one of the pre-made templates available inside your account. In videos, we don't have a dedicated editor, but that's not the case here. Create Studio's editor is pretty powerful and is intuitive. You can easily create a video by dragging and dropping different elements onto the canvas and by assigning them actions. There is a large collection of media, props, and characters as well. We can create different types of animations by using the various settings inside the editor. Another thing I love about Create Studio is its ability to create doodle animation videos. 
That means I don't need to invest in a separate Doodle Creator software. Now, let's look at the pricing. Both of these tools are available for one-time prices that give you lifetime access to these platforms. For $67, you can get Create Studio Standard Plan that gives you unlimited access to the tool for a lifetime. When it comes to videos, you can get lifetime access for a one-time payment of $77. Also, you can render 30 videos per month. If you want to render unlimited videos, you will have to get the commercial license by paying a one-time fee of $97. These were some of the major differences between Create Studio and Videos. Now we have clear differences. Let's see which one comes out on top. Both of these video animation tools are great in their own ways. The quality of video animations you get is also really good. I personally own both of these tools. That's how I prefer to do it. But if you are a beginner, and if you want to choose one, I recommend you get Create Studio. Why? Because there is so much more you can do with this tool. Videos is a good choice if you are only looking to create certain kinds of intros, outros, overlays, etc. But with Create Studio, possibilities are endless. You can check out my review videos and articles to learn more about these tools. The links are in the description below. I will see you in another video.